What's up everybody? Welcome back to the 710 Performance YouTube channel. Hope you all are having an amazing day. Guess what? Today is moving day. We're getting ready to kick things off. I know that not having a skin on the outside of this has kind of been an eyesore for some of you. What is good is since we're cutting the oven down to half size, we're going to be able to take some of the extra skin that we've got there. We're going to be able to place it on the outside so we'll actually have a floor and two side panels that are skinned after the move. But what we're going to do right now is we don't know if this is going to be multi-vlogs or if we're going to kind of catch it all in one. Right now we're going to tear this oven down. A little bit later you'll catch us as we go pick up the Penske truck and then we're going to load everything up and if things go right we will be headed out of here this evening. If not worse comes to worse it will be tomorrow morning but chances are we will just leave here and drive a few hours and then sleep on the road. So we're going to road vlog. It's going to be crazy. So make sure you come on in and check it out. Let's do this. videos but some of you may not have caught it you can check it out on some of our build videos but really what we got going on here is we knew that we were not going to be in this shop forever of course we planned on moving to a bigger one not necessarily a smaller one but you know what that's a different story and life is what it is and we're going to make it grand no matter what it throws at us big thing is is we knew at some point in time we were going to move and we were going to need to move the oven so we made it extremely easy to disassemble so we can reassemble. All we've got to do is drill out some rivets on where it's riveted together. We can go ahead and cut it in half. Basically, we just drill out the rivets, pull it apart, and then we'll drill out the rivets on all of the other pieces so we can go ahead and shrink this half down. We'll be able to load up that half in the truck. Just so you know, that's what we're doing when you see us drilling stuff and taking it apart, is we actually planned to be able to take this apart to be able to move it.
Welcome all back to the vlog. So we were able to get the oven temporary move, temporarily moved in or moved into its temporary spot where we're gonna be for the next couple of months as we get things straight with the building out here. Thanks to Austin, he's allowing us to go ahead and continue to do our work so we can make videos for you guys as well as start to get our name out here for powder coating. You see this amazing truck here behind us. Actually, I think a lot of you may have seen stories of this truck when he blew the transmission on the way out to Denver. Now he's got it pretty much back together. He has just a few final things to do, so you're gonna see some of that in these videos. But we did get the oven moved in. We are going to make some changes to the oven as we spoke to you guys about before. We are gonna add a bottom to it and we are going to go ahead and put some metal on some of the outside pieces. We're gonna go ahead and just kind of cover up some of the insulation that we didn't have covered up before. So it's going to be looking a lot nicer as well. We're gonna be doing that over the next couple of days and then by next Monday, we should be hitting projects really hard. We also have some videos for Avalon King that's coming up. We have some ceramic coating that we're going to be trying over powder coat and then we're gonna do some durability tests for you guys. Maybe uh, drag them down this dirt road and kind of see how well stuff can hang up. We've got some awesome stuff like that coming so make sure you're subscribed to the channel and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Perfect.